hey guys welcome back again to my youtube channel just in case you are new here welcome to my channel my name is esther and if you haven't subscribed yet what are you waiting for kindly hit on the red subscribe button below and don't forget to hit the little bell icon in that way you always get notified whenever i upload a new update so guys sorry for not posting for over a week now i've been busy because of christmas yeah i'm back now so let's dive right into today's video regina daniel's birthday message to her husband prince ned wonko as he celebrates his 60th birthday as the day goes by it gladdens my heart to see how much of a potential leader you have it's another year and would have wished wisdom and riches but I just remembered you are synonymous to King Solomon. Happy birthday, Lion King. To long life, good health, happiness, and unity that befits a man of valor. I love you, baby. At Prince Ned Wonko. Go. How many people? You think my people is like your father's one? <laughs> eh? This one is standing. No. Oh. Oh, 4,000 viewers. Oh, my God. Wait, what? Oh, my God. Oh, my God. I thought I was hated, though. Thank you, guys. 5,000. Oh! My chest. My chest. My chest. My chest. 5,003 followers. 3,000. Oh, my God. 9 million followers. It was scary. Why is your face like that? Ah. Hey, Baba. It went up. Hey, Baba. Yes, mom is recording you going live. So, bye, guys. The last one was so good. There's nothing you think you can do to satisfy anybody. Satisfy your own self and to Almighty God. Except when your God said, No, you are going astray. You are doing wrong. That's when you will now retrieve back your step. But if whatever you are doing, and you are doing it to the glory of God, and He sees your heart, not, how, not what they judge about you. If God has not judged you, you don't have any right to succumb to people's depression or frustration. The person that you are only entitled to is Almighty. And yourself, your family, okay? They will always talk. 
or you know what they are saying is not true. So don't allow what people say bring you down. Mm -hmm. Always stand firm. Once you are on a solid rock, firm on the ground, nothing can push you. Do you know the only thing? So give it back to them, stepping forward from grace to grace, from grace to grace, from grace to grace. No, but allow they give grace to my God. He said, I will bless those that bless you and curse those that curses you. Any man that blesses you shall, shall benefit from your blessing. Mm -hmm. But anyone that curses you shall also benefit from what he or she has said with your mouth. Our tongue is meant to bless and not to curse. Mm. Do not speak ill or evil about anybody. Love your brothers, love your sisters, love your neighbor as yourself. Woe betide you when you look down on anyone. Woe betide you when you castigate anyone. How do you want to be uplifted? It's not possible. It's what you ask that you will receive. When you see those that have been blessed, rejoice with them. Embrace them. Don't hide it. No pretense. The Almighty God that sees in secret knows your heart. When you are truly appreciating them, He will bless you accordingly. According to what you have in your heart. Not lip service. From the depth of your heart, the mouth speaketh. Oh God Almighty, I'm happy with the way you bless this person. You are not hiding it. You are speaking from the depth, from your heart, from your soul and body. Definitely, the Almighty God will never lead you astray. He will shift that blessing. He will come, he give you your own cuts. Because why? You appreciated the effort of that person. You appreciated the God's blessing upon that life. Indirectly, you are asking God to remember you. Okay? Am I speaking your mind? Yes. <laughs> Okay.